Today we are removing the stereo from a 2008 Mazda MX-5. There are several styles of radio with this system, Bose and non-Bose. This is the non-Bose system and we're going to remove the stereo. Uh, down at the bottom left, of just below the AC controls, is a little slot that you can pry in and it will remove the left side panel with the clips, they all pull forward. On the uh, right side, we have the same little opening way up the very top, and the panel will come forward from the dash. All the clips release with pry pressure and set this panel to the side. Next, we're going to start with the uh, Phillips screw sort at the center between the uh, AC controls and stereo on the side of the radio and remove this screw. Uh, I suggest you watch this video all the way through before attempting to pull this out because you may miss an important step here towards the end. Uh, on the right side we're going to do the same and remove the Phillips screw to the left of the car stereo. Next we're going to move towards the below the steering column and pry this panel below the dash down and remove this panel. This is going to give access to another metal panel here down on the bottom. We're going to remove the left Phillips screw, the one above this screw. We're going to move to the right and remove the lower Phillips screw for this metal panel that goes across underneath the dash and then the upper screw. We're going to need a 10 millimeter socket and an extension. And we're going to get down here and move a screw that goes into the right side of the car stereo. Uh, what we're looking for is a, uh, now that we're up here behind the dash with a little bit more light, you're going to see two bolts right there in the center of the bracket going from the top to the bottom of the screen here. But the screw you want is to the right. Uh, over here more where the light is brighter. Uh, this radio has been out of the car before so we're gonna say that uh, this screw is presently missing from this location so you are looking for a third screw to remove from up here. Now we remove the uh, screw down the left side we're gonna come back to the face of the radio and the AC controls and they will pull forward from the dash. Now there are several connectors here uh, we've already had the stereo out of the dash once. The connectors were, were caught way back in the dash and it was very difficult to get to these. But at the back of the AC control, there is a connector here at the bottom of it. We will get to the, this connector and how it disconnects here in a moment when we get a little bit more space to see here. We're going to pull the car stereo forward and we have the main connector right here at the top. We're going to push the trigger down on this right here with our thumb and this will remove the connector. Next, the antenna sits over here on the left side of the car stereo. We're going to grasp the base of that and remove that. Now for the AC control, this was the connector for the AC control. This also had a trigger that you push down and it will release from the AC controls. All these connectors are keyed so they only fit one spot. Uh, inside the opening we have this metal bracket along the left side of the car stereo here. This is where that uh, hidden screw comes through this panel and uh, bolts into the right side of the stereo. We've been through this car, it looks like it's been apart before. There may be pieces missing to this one, the reason for this screw to be missing in the first place. Uh, this is how you remove the stereo out of a 2008 Mazda MX-5. We hope this video has been helpful. Watch our other videos. Thank you for watching.